the witness is dead. There was no predicting what would come next. But this is what we know. When the witness fell, the Black Fleet's eons of salvation and death surged. Its darkness merged with the Traveler's light, formed first into memory, and then into shape. This impossible object, this echo of the fleet's victims, holds immense power. And it was left for anyone to find. The echo grants the ability to compel. To control. To command. And with it, the conductor has the potential to turn their threat into our annihilation. Loyalty to the Vanguard does not go unrewarded, Guardian. Be our eyes. I don't want you to record. Genocide. Thousands of civilizations across the universe, all visited by the Black Fleet all lost to the violence of the final shape. That's where this echo comes from. At least, that's our theory. Reports from the Pale Heart, readings on the valence emanating from the Traveler. Everything we faced when we stared down the Witness and broke its fleet. At first, we didn't know what to call them, but Echo seemed apt. Memories from the victims of the Pyramids, held by the darkness. Then coalesced by the light, into artifacts as sharp and fatal as their pain. If darkness is memory, and light is form, what else could they be? But, there's still so much we don't know. Is this the only one? What forgotten people gave form to this echo? What was their final cry at their end? For control? A means to turn back their oppressors? My Hidden will keep searching for whatever answers the Witness's death can give us. Hopefully they number more than the questions it left behind. But we need to stop the Conductor and secure the Echo. Guardian, descend into Nessus. Massive amounts of Radiolaria have been diverted beneath the planet's crust. We need to find out what the Vex are building there. 